I am Usman from Pakistan, Mantak Chia, a Taoist master who teaches how to control semen and he also teaches some exercises which increases time duration during sex with your spouse. Is it allowed in Islam to follow the methods he teaches just to increase time duration during intercourse? The question poses that is this statement allowed? The basic answer for any such question that is this statement allowed, is this therapy allowed, that if that treatment, if that therapy doesn't break any teachings of the Islamic Sharia, it's permitted. If it breaks, it's not permitted. If it doesn't break any teachings of the Quran or the Sai Hadith, it's permitted. If it follows the Sharia, this is the basic. But normally you have to understand that if you go to a conventional doctor who may be an allopathy doctor who has gone and normal done his MBBS or his MD, it's easier to know whether the treatment is right or wrong. You can go to any specialist who has Islamic knowledge and knows about the medicine and ask him, he'll be able to tell you. Or the person can Google and try and find the, try and find the treatment and he can tell you whether it's allowed or not. So as a general ruling, any treatment which is haram, that should not be done. But there are exceptions to the rule that if it is a last resort and the only thing that can save the, the life of a Muslim, then that treatment, though it may not be permitted, as a last resort can be permitted. As Allah says in several places in the Quran, in Surah Baqarah chapter 2 verse number 173, in Surah Mahindah chapter 5 verse number 3, in Surah Anam chapter 6 verse 145, and Surah Nahal chapter 16 verse 115 Forbidden for you for food are dead meat, blood, the flesh of swine and any food on which any name besides Allah name is taken. And it continues that if any person unwillingly disobeys God, Allah is Rahman or Rahim, is Ghafur or Rahim. That means if generally pork is haram, but Maybe you have gone out in a boat and got lost in the sea. There is no food except pork. For that time, pork becomes permitted. Now, coming to your question regarding this Taoist master, he is giving some treatment so that you can have a better relationship with your wife or can increase the time duration. Is it allowed? Answer is the same. If he is asking you to do something which is against the Quran and Sunnah, it is haram. If he is not asking you to do something which is against the Quran and Sunnah, it is permitted. Now you may be knowing certain things which are allowed, you may not be knowing all the things. So if you go to a person with knowledge of Islam and science, a normal person is aware of the medical treatments that are there. But this Taoist master, I don't know what treatment is giving. So I can only give a general answer if it's nothing against the Quran, Sunnah, it's permitted. Something they may tell you, for example, he may tell you to look at obscene things. Of course it's Saddam, you are aware of that. But he may tell you something which you are not aware of. So in this case, you'll have to describe the complete procedure to someone who has knowledge of the deen and science and explain to him if it's not breaking any rule of the Islamic Sharia, not going against any teachings of Quran, say that it's permitted. If it's going against any teachings of Quran and Sunnah, then it is not permitted and you should not take that treatment. Hope that answers the question.